After takeoff, the plane follows an unusual, erratic course. You would wonder what, what really was happening. As if there were no crew in the cockpit. The investigation is at a standstill when it gets a major boost. Let's get that out. The flight recorders are recovered. Yeah, that's it. They may reveal why the plane was flown so erratically. Exterior checks complete. The team listens to the cockpit voice recorder for any sign of trouble. We wanted to try to get a better understanding if there might have been some kind of mechanical problem. The takeoff sounds completely normal. Broken. Then investigators hear the controller give the pilots a new heading. But that's not the direction the plane flies. As they approached the heading that they had been assigned, they overshot the heading. They're way off course. Sir, I suggest that due to the weather, you follow heading 270 to be in the clear. Each time the pilots try to correct their course, they turn too far and bank too steeply. Ethiopian 409, you are going into the mountain. Turn right now, heading 270. The airplane was rolling into an ever steeper bank. Ultimately leading to a spiral. Nothing on the recording indicates a mechanical failure. It was just something that we certainly didn't have any answers for in the beginning. Investigators scour the cockpit recording for clues they may have missed. Exterior checks complete. Check complete, no problems. They notice something odd. During the takeoff roll, you see that? The captain saw something because he tells his first officer, did you see that? But then there was no reaction from the first officer. The first officer is silent. OK. Engage the autopilot. Hold on. Stop for a second. That would have changed things. The advantage of engaging the autopilot in that situation is that the pilot can then let the autopilot worry about the attitude of the airplane while he sits back and takes the big picture, maintains situational awareness. But the autopilot was never turned on, nor was there a reply to the captain's order. Had the autopilot been engaged when the captain ordered the first pilot to engage it, would have saved the whole flight. Investigators need to find out why the first officer failed to act. <laughs> 